Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel and for today's video, since bet nyo yung mga glowy look, I did a natural glowy look before and I also did a natural everyday look. So today, gawin naman natin is an easy glowy look for everyday using these products na go-to ko lately. So parang updated version na rin to. So without further nash, let us start with the video. Okay, alam ko may magtatanong since medyo glowy na rin yung ng skin ko ngayon. Ito yung sunscreen na ginamit ko. It's the Isentry Hyaluronic Watery Sun Gel. Napakita ko na rin to sa last video ko. And then, I also use yung favorite ko na super peptide serum ng Good Molecules. I super love that. Not exaggerating, more than 10 bottles na ata yung nagamit ko noon kasi 2 years ko na yun ginagamit. So, whenever I do yung mga glowy makeup looks, I make sure na in-incorporate ko na rin siya sa skin prep pa lang. So, that parang glowing ka talaga from within, hindi lang through makeup. And speaking of glowing from within, this is something that I wish I knew earlier. As in, kung kaklose ko lang si Heart Evangelista, as in, the moment I discover this, it text ko siya kagad. Ibabalita ko kagad sa kanya tong discovery na to. Kasi sa kanya ko nalaman na as in siya, she consciously sleeps na nakapaharap. Hindi siya nagsisleep on her side. Lalong hindi siya nagsisleep na pada pa. Kasi she wants to prevent yung sleep wrinkles and puffiness. Kasi when we sleep, we sleep for about like average 6 to 8 hours a day. Lalo na kung side sleepers kayo like me. And when our face gets mush for constantly 6 to 8 hours a day, 7 days a week, that's what causes sleep wrinkles and puffiness. So it's the repeated pressure every day. Imagine 6 to 8 hours a day, 7 days a week, your face gets mush. So in case you're curious, yung sleep wrinkles are the vertical wrinkles. So you will see it around your eyes, the forehead, the mesolabial folds, while your expression wrinkles are the horizontal wrinkles. Again, the wrinkles is caused by the repeated pressure. Kaya, this is my solution. I've had this for months now. I've been meaning to share it with you, pero tinray ko muna siya. So this is the Sleep and Glow Omnia Pillow. As you can see, it's not your usual ordinary shaped pillow. This has a unique patented 3D design. So, meron siyang two side cradles, as you can see, that allows you to sleep on your side without smooshing, without compressing your skin during sleep. So, as you can see, meron kang support on the head, meron kang support on the chin, meron kang support on the neck. And this curve right here, lalo na again, if you're a side sleeper like me, it actually feels like you're floating. Above all, it's actually so comfortable. And again, the best part is, walang pressure. So, kung walang pressure, walang puffiness, walang wrinkles. Alam to ng husband ko, I always sleep on my left side. Kaya one time, merong doctor na nagtanong sa akin. Sabi niya, guro natutulog ka on one side of your face. Sabi ko, yes, doc, paano mo nalaman? Sabi niya, kasi halata na mas lowered yung other side ng face ko compared to the other side. That's why I wish I knew this earlier. But it's never too late. And yes, yung sleep wrinkles, it's not made up. It actually really exists. Kung check niyo actually yung website ni Sleep and Glow, makikita niyo doon yung mga kilalang doctors. Some, I even watch on TikTok. Na nire-recommend nila tong pillow na to because this is actually clinically tested. So, clinically proven siya that 82% of cases actually reduce sleep wrinkles after 3 months of using this pillow. And designed din siya by orthopedists to make sure na anatomically correct yung body position nyo when you sleep using this pillow. So, I'm just sharing my story because this for me is an investment kasi for me, when it comes to skin, when it comes to well aging, prevention is always, always better than cure. And I'm also happy to share with you that I partnered with Sleep and Glow to give you a discount code. Kasi guys, si Sleep and Glow never yan nagde-discount but thankfully, they gave us a discount code which is right here. So, it's Jocelle 10 so you can get 10% discount. So, ilalagay ko naman yung link sa description box on where you can check about the product, where you can order. They actually have a 3-year warranty and meron din silang 30-day trial money-back guarantee. Let me know in the comments in case you've tried it or you're about to try it or umorder kayo and na-try nyo na, kwentohan nyo ko in the comment section. Okay. Okay, now let's start with the makeup look. I also forgot to mention what I use on my brows. So I use the new Lovely Cosmetics na Arch Master Brow Gel for that laminated look. I've been loving this so far. And for the base, I've been loving this lately. I think na share ko naman to sa mga previous videos ko rin. So this is the Lovely Cosmetics Beyond Blur Skin Illuminator. And this is in the shade Light Medium. I never skip this one, lalo na if I want a glowy look. This is so nice on the skin. Like this will really 
give you literal na glass skin. Sometimes I use this on top of foundation, but for today, I want it underneath para talagang glowing tayo from within since gagamit pa naman tayo ng liquid highlighter later for that extra glow. See that? As in, para kang nag-exfoliate. Ganun yung dating niya on the skin, lalo na how it catches light. So, this is actually something that I can recommend if you're someone lagi nagre-record ng video, ng pictures, and you want your skin to appear glowy and healthy on camera. Ang ganda niya mag-catch ng light. And for the foundation, I've been contemplating which foundation to use kasi lagi na lang ito yung ginagamit ko. Pero for glowy looks, ito talaga yung best foundation finish for that. So, this is the Issy Active Foundation. I'm in the shade NL 2.5. Sobrang bet ko lang din talaga yung combination nito and ito for that natural glowy looks. Kapag gusto ko talagang ma-enhance yung skin, it has that natural glow na para kang pareha sila ni Illuminator na para kang nag-skincare ng bongga or para kang nagpa-laser the day before. <laughs> Ganon ka-glowy tingnan yung skin. And I also like how this is buildable. Tapos kahit i-build mo siya, as in hindi siya mabigat at all, it never looks foundation -y or cakey on the face. Sobrang perfect nung shade match. Look at that finish. That shade match. So nice. Okay, the base is basing so far. Very gency tayo doon. Now, for concealers, I actually have two options. Itong dalawa yung go-to ko lately since itong dalawa yung magkasabay halos ni release. Okay, ang difference lang naman nilang dalawa is yung consistency ni Lovely mas thick talaga siya. So, you only need a little to achieve that coverage. With Vice naman, it has a thin consistency. So, para lang talaga siyang nagbe-blend sa skin. But it also has enough coverage. For today, since I'm going for that very light lang naman na makeup look. I think I'll go for the Vice Skin Sealer. I use the shade Light Medium 1 on my under eyes. And this is the type of concealer na I find na hindi ko na kailangan i-marinate or i-wait na mas mag-set siya. Mas gusto ko siya na bini-blend kagad. But compared to the Lovely Cosmetics one with Vice, I like to work my way up. Magdadagdag na lang ako in case gusto ko pa ng added coverage. With Lovely kasi as in, a little goes a long way. Very effortless lang din siya i-blend. This is without the concealer, this is with the concealer. Actually, sa new collection ni Vice, si concealer yung pinaka-favorite ko na product sa lahat ng release nila. And look at that, instantly 8 hours of sleep. And then for my blush, I always mix two shades and ito yung go-to ko lately. These are from Lucky Beauty. These are their ethereal liquid pigments and I always mix the shade First Love and Gypsy. So I go first with the deeper shade. With this formulation, literally a little goes a very long way. Minsan pag napapasobra ko, binabawasan ko by tapping the excess on the back of my hand. But it actually is so blendable. So, kahit mapasobra kayo, you can share it out. This is a very nice shade. This is in Gypsy. And then, for the added freshness, let's use First Love. I'm putting it sa inner part ng cheeks ko. Let's blend it with the same brush para mag-blend siya with the first blush shade. Kanina. And then, damay natin yung nose. Ganda talaga. Ang ganda talagang pagaluin itong dalawang to. Super love those two on my cheeks as in. Let's contour very lightly lang. I'll use itong strokes na face sculpt in Amon. This is also what I use for my nose contour. Alam nyo na yan, pag nose contour, I like using my fingers para napipress ko talaga siya dun sa buto. Buto ba yun? Or cartilage. For setting the face, since I don't want to cancel the glowiness, I'll just use a finishing powder. So, depende na yun sa inyo. If you have oily skin, definitely you can bake. Pero, remedyan nyo na lang with the highlighting products that you're going to use para ma-achieve nyo pa rin yung glowy skin. But for today, I will use itong bago ng Vice Cosmetics. So, this is the Vice Co. Universal Fix Universal Bake Setting Powder and this is in natural. Actually, sobrang bare minimum powder lang nito. Ang nagagawa niya lang talaga is lightly set the face. As in, very, very lightly. But what I like about this is that when I'm going for glowy looks, it doesn't fully cancel out the sheen that I want. As you can see, I'm going over my cheeks but nandun pa rin yung sheen. So this is a side without, this is with the powder. And don't worry, meron pa tayong gagamitin later to bring back that glow. There you go. See, nandun pa rin yung sheen. And then I'll just do my brows. Again, using itong favorite ko. What's new? The Izzy & Co. Brow Detailing Pen in Warm Brown. As in, very lightly lang. I'm just filling up the areas where I need to. 
before, I would use the same brow product as my eyeliner. But for today's video, since bago to ni Izzy and I enjoyed using this, we will use this Izzy Gel Pencil Extreme in the shade Diva. This is yung parang chocolate brown shade nila. And once you put it, as in dapat, blend ka agad kasi it sets right away. Dapat within 5 seconds, blend ka na. Dito lang naman ako naglalagay kasi I want that very natural shadow lang just to lift up the eyes. I'm okay with this na. I like that undetectable wing. I just like to naturally open up my eyes. And now to set our cream blush, we will be using from the same family. Sobrang favorite ko to lately. As in, this is my go-to blush. My current signature blush. This is the Lucky Beauty Aura Blush in Passionate. Sobrang ganda nito. Whenever I use this, lagi may nagtatanong ani yung blush na gamit ko. That's how beautiful it is. Tapos ang maganda sa kanya, hindi siya yung chalky na blush. Wala siyang masyadong fall out. I super love this na umorder na ako ng backup ko nito. Also last pretty well on me. Look at that. Ang ganda talaga. I also like this on my nose and on my chin. And dinadami ko rin yung eyelids ko as always. Period. Wow. Super love that blush. It's so flattering. Next, ngayon ko lang na-realize, sanami palang Lucky Beauty dito sa look na to. But so far, they are slaying with their new releases. These are my current favorite face highlighter. Ang ganda nito. Mas favorite ko siya kasi dun sa powder formulation nila. This looks so good. As in, it looks so naturally glowy on the cheeks. Ito yung pinaka main weapon with this look. So, these are the Lucky Beauty Ethereal Liquid Glow. These are two of my favorite shades. This is in Citrine and this is in Rose Quartz. I like using the shade Rose Quartz on my cheeks. Lalo na I'm using a pinkish blush. I'm just putting this on the high points of my cheeks. I just blend it with my fingers. And look at that. Ang ganda talaga. Whenever I use this, na amaze pa rin ako. And I'll just also put here. I love it. And then I like using the shade Citrine on the other parts of my face, like my nose, my cupid's bow, my chin, and my inner corners. Actually, si Moonstone, or yung parang pinaka pearly white nila na shade, ang ganda rin nun sa inner corners. Look at that. Closer look. <laughs> I love it so much. Now for the eyes. So, hindi ko na i -re curl yung eyes ko since nag-curl na ako kanina. Ayoko rin ng super duper curl ngayon for this look. So, I'll be using ito yung current go-to ko ngayon na mascara. This is the Izzy Maximizing Mascara. This is the perfect everyday mascara. It's not the most dramatic mascara. Although, you can build it up. As in, you can put up to 4 layers of this mascara to get your desired volume. But ako kasi, for that everyday clean your look, I just put one layer and okay na ako sa kanya. Actually, ito, yung mascara base pa lang yan. Pero minsan, okay na ako dyan, even without putting the mascara itself. The best part din kasi with this, ang dali niyang tanggalin since it's a tubing mascara. And never siya nag-smudge. Never ako nagkaroon ng panned eyes with this. Kaya, lagi ko na yung mascara itself. Actually, grabe rin talaga yung volume ito. But again, what I like about it is pwede mo siyang timplahin. This is with the mascara. This is without. Lastly, for the lips, this is my current favorite lip tint. This is from Arcade Beauty. This is their daily lip tint in the shade Harmony. Oh my god, nagkamali ako ng hugot. Si Bliss pala to. Pero pwede na rin. Bagay rin siya sa look natin. And this is actually one of my favorite shades as well. Favorite ko si Bliss, Harmony, and si Divine. I-mix na lang natin sila ni Harmony. This is Harmony. And since we're going for that glowy look, syempre dapat glowy din yung lips. So this is also my current favorite lip gloss. So this is from Sunny's Face. This is their Glide Gloss in the shade Rose Water. I super love this formulation. Meron akong gustong bilhin ng ganito from Hourglass. Buti na lang, Sunny's Face came up with something similar. It's a high shine gloss stick. I love it. 
Medyo makalat lang siya, so linisan nyo na lang yung gilid after yung gamitin. And this is the final easy glowy makeup look for everyday. Look at that glow. It's so nice. Ang maganda dito, it looks so nice and natural on camera as it is in person. As in, hindi kayo mukhang too makeup-y in person. Alam mo yung parang ang ganda lang talaga nung skin mo. That's how it looks like both on camera, both on artificial lighting and on natural lighting and in person. So medyo inayos ko lang yung hair ko, but that's it for today's look. I hope you liked it. Yung something na pasok pa rin sa natural makeup category. Let me know na lang kung meron kayo mga questions. But lahat ng ginamit ko na products will be linked in the description box below. And kung meron din kayo mga video suggestions, sabihan nyo lang ako sa comments. Thank you, thank you so much for watching. Kung hindi pa kayo nakasubscribe, you might want to consider subscribing to my channel and liking this video as well. Thank you, thank you so much for watching this video. And I hope to still see you in my next one. Bye!